Here is another one of those things you will need to think about if you are going to pre-assemble a set of stairs and then install it between two stationary walls. And that will be to have a definite understanding on how you're going to install it in between the walls and without scratching those walls. So let's go ahead and take a look at a set of stairs here that you might be able to build it a half inch smaller than the width of the wall just to make sure that you don't scratch it. You're not going to want to build something the exact size and then not have it fit. But that's not my job here. My job is to get you thinking before doing. So I think it'll work if you do something like this and just kind of work it in between the walls and take your time doing it just a little bit at a time and hope that everything will work out for the best. Now I do understand that they make pre-assembled stairs that do not fit in between two walls. However, this video was actually inspired by another video that I watched where the people might have been using a little trickery because I don't know how this could actually be done and I think it will make a little more sense here in a few seconds. And the stairway they were trying to install looks something like this, even though I couldn't see the bottom. But you can see where the bottom isn't going to matter. It's the sides that will matter. And how in the heck are you going to get a stairway like this to fit in between these walls without, for one, destroying those walls or destroying the stairway? And even if I remove the skirt board, I can't see how I would be able to install this set of stairs here in between the two walls. And I hope I'm not trying to sound like this is impossible. Just trying to point out some of the stuff that you might not be thinking about. And if I was going to build a set of stairs between two walls, I am not going to do something like this.